Okay, let's have a look at this goal here. It comes from a free hit. Uh, we'll just take it forward. You can see right now the free hit's about to take place. Um, this guy here who has the ball now, he's the one taking the free hit. Okay, as of right now, the black team's in a pretty good position. They have one, two, three, four, five against one, two, three, four players. And they're holding the middle of the court quite nicely. You can see that this area through here is quite solidly defended. So he takes a free hit. And he knocks it to this guy which immediately <clears throat> draws the attention of this guy here, and rightfully so, because that's his player. If you look at how they're numbered up, this guy should be with this guy, this guy should be with this guy, this guy should be with this guy, these two guys are obviously together, and this guy should be with this <clears throat> last defender up here. So he takes it. This guy steps in, looking to cut into this space here, or even potentially through here. But he's just trying to exploit the space that's in there. So, sorry, I'll draw that a little bit neater. Between here and here. So he steps in. Makes it look like he's going to shoot by carrying the ball in a shooting position, which forces this guy to play it as if he will get a shot through and will attempt the shot. He then knocks the ball down to this guy here on the boards. But you can see by bringing the ball in, once he releases it, He's brought the ball in this way and he's drawn this defender in with him which then creates space pretty much if you imagine this line going behind the defender here this guy has all this space on the boards even right into this area here He's got plenty of space to work with when he gets it. From here, the player gets the ball. You saw him fake the shot there. Which means this guy goes down into the block. And he does so because even though the fake was pretty obvious, he could still get a shot away a wrist shot from where he is now. And then he threads the ball straight through the middle to this guy on the far side who has the entire net there to pretty much just tap it in. And if we go back We'll look at a couple of things the defense could have done better. Number one, this guy here could have stepped up a little bit to limit this space here. He 
his partner's already numbered up in front of the net. Yes, it's not a bad idea to have, you know, favourable numbers, two against one in front of the net, in case of a rebound or a loose ball. But if he had stepped up just a bit, stepped out, he could have uh, put this guy here under a bit more pressure. And you see he gets the ball here and he's got so much space to work with. However, the real problem is that this guy is only looking at the ball here and he was previously as well. I'll take it back a bit. You can tell that he's, he's concerned with the pass getting through here because he's got his stick down and he's watching this player here. The problem is he's got no vision on this guy. This guy is free to roam wherever he wants to go. And this defender has no idea of his position relative to him. So, if this guy had have drifted this way, for example, you can see that there is a passing lane there. He may have been able to get that through. And this guy would have been in the wrong position. Sorry, this defender would have still been in the wrong position. And as we go through the clip to here, as the ball comes down to the guy at the, the boards, the half wall, you can see still he's trying to maintain that position there and to cut this pass through here, but he's not able to do it because he's got his eyes only on the ball and he's got no idea where this guy is. Because even if this next pass ends up being the assist, didn't get through cleanly. Even if the, the ball ended up in a, like in no man's land just here, this defender still has no idea how much space he's got to work with or to shut down. This, this other guy would have just jumped on it and had a shot. It may not have been a goal. So what he could have done is starting from back here what I would have preferred to see would be this guy down here somewhere standing inside and probably a stick length away if that of his opposite number there. That way, if he's positioned here and he's got his, this is a key point here, if he's got his feet facing this way rather than towards the ball, then his shoulders will be square to the goal lines, parallel with the goal lines. And he won't have this guy directly behind his back. He will have it inside, sorry, wrong tool. If he stands with his feet facing this way from here, his back facing this way, he would have a field of vision, something like this. And from there, you can see that he would be able to see this guy here and the ball. And if the pass came through, he'd be able to anticipate it. If the pass came through this way, he'd be able to anticipate it. As we move through the clip, uh, 
as of right now, if he had have maintained that position so that he had vision over the guy he's supposed to be marking here and the ball carrier, then he would have ended up with his feet again. He would be his feet facing this way, his back would be here somewhere, and he would have a field of vision from here to here, because all he's got to do is move his head on his neck a bit and he'd be able to see it. And you can see if he were in that position, yes he would have been able to to get the pass yes i can see that um you know some some people would make the argument well by moving out of this center position he's going to leave all this space in here for the guy who's got the ball now to come into however that's going to be a lot easier to handle for this guy and for our old mate here in the net because what currently happens is the ball goes right across the middle and the guy in the net has absolutely no hope of getting it it would be much better to have this guy here have to dribble it in because dribbling moves the ball slower along the surface area of the court then it it's much better to have that than to have him pass from here all the way to here and it gets there in less than half a second because now the goalie has no chance